The question is, is Zac Efron an underrated actor? Yes. I'm going to agree with you. The answer for me is also yes, but we've got to do fact of the day, page number 269, fact number two. The African giant pouched rat can smell tuberculosis 50 times faster than a laboratory scientist can identify it. Huh, I suppose they don't want to eat people with TB? Or maybe they do want to eat people with TB. Maybe that's true. I don't know what these pouch rats in Africa are on, but they might be on TB. Maybe. That would be very bad. That's a monster rat there. Rats are kind of disastrous, but a TB hunting rat? I think this is how we get, you know, 2.0, 2019, 2020. Yeah. That type of shenanigans. I think We so. don't want that. Hey! Narendra the Comic Ant. Nonsense. Yes, so right now we're going to be reacting to this trailer for this new movie called Ricky Stenicky. What a name. What a name. What a title. Now, who came up with this? I don't know. I don't want to know because I just want to go in with no awareness as to what this movie truly is. I know that some of the cast, big name cast. Big name. I know you are going to love some of the cast. I think She I only knows Zac Efron's in it and that's it. Okay, well, if you're that excited, can we just get to the trailer? Let's get to the trailer, baby. Let's go. It's the Nikki. What up, man? Are you serious? Have someone call me when you get out of surgery, all right? You should drive out there. Ricky's been there for you guys your whole lives. The devil's in the details, my friend. <laughs> it worked. Atlantic City, here how we is... come. Oh, we got Andrew Ricky's Santino. Cancer. Yeah, how what? is Andrew oh, Santino? Won't everybody get worried? Yeah. And that's going to take us right into the World Series. Ricky's the The best friend we never dies. Mm. Oh. My baby's gonna be born six weeks early. I was born six weeks early. Oh, shit. <laughs> I wanna know where the hell you guys were tonight. We called every hospital and there was no record of a Ricky Stanicki. You know, all we did was tell one lie. Hundreds and hundreds of times over many, many years. If the truth does come out, my marriage is oh. over. What if we hire an actor <sighs> to play oh. Stanicki? <laughs> Rock hard rod. X-rated rock and roll in person. Stop it. I do a whole act. Wall to wall, top to bottom, jizz jams. Thanks for coming out tonight, ladies and gentlemen. So horny to be here. This is a really bad idea. <laughs> oh, Jesus. I've been cold turkey in the booze. Ricky Snicky's in the program, remember? Oh, Rod. It's not what you think it is. It's just best. Oh. Oh. But every time, no my muff. I want you to admit that Ricky Snicky does not exist. Hey, must hook Oh. Yes. This is Ted Summerhays, my boss. Ted, nice to meet you. Digging the suit and the seedlings, man. The seedlings. The hair plugs are new, right? This is my hair. We're gonna lose our jobs. Oh. Best friend. She a real bad gonna dance for her. Epic night, am I right, guys? I was really taken with your friend Stanicki. He's got brass balls on him, that guy. That's why I hired him. Oh, oh. that's awesome. You just said. What did you say? Just say it one more time. We can't let them out of our sight. Not only did I miss the birth of my son, but I let some poor old Peter Frampton impersonator snip his. And we're done. Stinicky, you are unbelievable. Show's over, Rod. It's Ricky. Ricky Stinicky isn't real. Oh, my job sucked. I have no friends. I messed up. But now I have all those things. Oh, oh, oh. Are you a fraud, sir? What are you talking about? It's my best friend. We gotta get rid of him. Every time he tries to make a point, it's like he's smoking invisible dogs. Dear God, it's true. To support. Now it looks like I'm cupping the balls. <sighs> now nah, this, this is what I've been wanting so much. The concept itself, it just lends itself to all different styles of comedy. Mm -hmm. The fact that they cast John Cena to play a man mm. who doesn't exist. Invisible. Who can't be seen. <laughs> can't be uh -huh. seen, if you will. Wow, that went over my head, actually. Oh, really? That went over my head. Thank you for not telling me anything Andrew about Andrew Santino? Oh, my God, I What? Mean, the ginger ninja himself? That tells me this is going to be good. Is Bobby Lee going to make a cameo? Yes. Do we get a Bobby Lee cameo? Yes, we do. <laughs> Does Bobby Lee run the strip club that John Cena's working at? Please. Please. Please make it be that. <laughs> We need more of this stuff, don't we? Yeah, we do. There's not enough funny shit going about. And if this is just stupid funny, I'll take it. Generally, comedies are put on streaming nowadays. They don't go into cinemas. But I do think something like this, with the cast it has, may actually do well, dependent on the budget. That's something they should think about. I don't know whether Prime's gonna want to put this in cinemas, even if it's for a limited release, maybe two, three weeks. I think they should, considering there's this whole problem with releases of movies in theatres because the writing strike, because the acting strike. If you have
have something that is good, just put it out in cinemas. That might be the best thing to do, especially for the next year where there is going to be a dry run. There's not going to be enough productions that have been made and there are going to be empty weekends at the cinemas. I want the comedy comeback. I want to see films that are comedies getting towards the top 10 in the year. If they're good. If they're good. If they're bad. If they're bad. And generally they're bad nowadays. But the thing is, this looks like it could be good. It could be good, but it looks stupid good, not good good. Yeah, it looks like that trashy good, and I like it, but I admit it's trash. They gave away the whole story in the trailer. And yet, I'm still gonna want to see it in the cinema. But did they need to give the whole story away in the trailer? No. They didn't need to do it. They could have just gone with the first minute and a half and then left the remaining part. They wanted to tell you, oh no, there's gonna be more to this film than just the beginning aspect of it. And it's them trying to get rid of him once he's actually integrated into their lives. Yeah, it's a big problem. Big, That's problem. big problem. He's a big guy. You're making problems for yourself, sir. This sounds like a Reddit thread being like, ah, I got caught. Ah, you're so right. Right, you're on a so throwaway right. account. Don't yeah. you think so? Yeah. This is 100% that. So this is bringing that to new people. You're fumbling your words so much. <laughs> this is going to be so difficult to cut together, but it's just because you're excited. Yes, I am. You're happy. You're enthused. And that's why you're fumbling your words. Anyway, guys, if you did enjoy this video, please like, share, comment, and subscribe to the channel down there. If you didn't, what you're doing? you got one thing to do, that is subscribe. What should they be doing? Subscribe. Great. Now, I've been the original comic. I've been on She's Sensei. She's been on Sensei. You have been great. And we'll see you next time. That's tomorrow. If you don't know, make a video every single day. Been doing it every day for over 2,000 days now. We are stopping till we get to 10,000 subscribers. So do subscribe. Pop back again tomorrow for some more quality. Shitty content. So hashtag never not here. Hashtag goes. Also bring the quas, quas means nonsense. Imp and jumpy. We also bring that bring a lot. Bring a little, do a lot, do a little boy. Do indeed bring the quality. Shitty content on a daily basis. So see you tomorrow for more of the same, slightly different, but essentially the very same. Once more, see you then. Skadoosh. <laughs>